socks. Finding the right pair of your socks once they are dumped inside your cupboard could be a mission, a challenge to find. So what do we do in this case is what we are going to show to you on how. <laughs> Like you see, I have this mountain full of socks which are mixed up and piled up over here. And I'll show you. First, let me just clear this place and here. We'll start with this teeny tiny one, a pink color sock that I have. And what I'll do is I'll put the heel side outwards and I'll take the other pair as well and place it on top of it with the heel side again facing outwards. Then I'll just roll it from the toe side upwards, toe side upwards, and then the back end of the sock you just pull it all over the thing and there it's all covered and secured all inside this small pocket it looks neat very presentable and not quite space consuming this is another way where i'll place the sock downwards and the heel side would be upwards as you can see the other one i place it in a cross position again with the heel side upwards what I'll do is I'll fold one end and bring, put it in the other side. The other end I'll just fold it like this. Now if it's bigger you would need to leave it like this and then put another fold. I'll do the same with the other open side. I'll take it and I'll tuck it in the fold that I have already got from the previous uh, fold that I made. <laughs> and this side also I'll fold and you can just pull it through and tuck it inside the other fold so this is how it looks a very square shape it's way too professional and time consuming for me but however if you like it neat this is another way then as you can see these are a uh, pair of socks that i have and what i do is basically facing the heel side sideways for both the sock i'll place them downwards again just arrange it and this is quite an easy way the the top end that you see from the back side you would fold it over in this way and then you'll have just a dangling thing down so this method is quite quick but I feel you know maybe if it gets pulled it might loosen up and come out so not that secure this is the final way that I have what I'll do is I'll take one sock with the heel side again outwards and the other over it. Now I'll fold this exactly into half like this and then I'll make another half and the back end that you see on top I'll pull it all the way through the whole thing and you'll just have a pocket size cover which also looks pretty neat. This is the way you can basically store your socks this is one way this is the dangling way another one and then we have the square type of a folding and this is the one which has a roll thing so make use of this method so the next time when you have got your socks washed you know what you have to do fold it with these three kind of steps that I have shown you the easy way of folding your socks and then you can store them in your cupboard and then be hassle free of searching the other pair of your socks which is dumped in the cupboard. Hope this hack comes in use to all of you all out there and uh, a request for those of you all who have not yet subscribed to my channel please 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 do not forget and click on the subscribe button and the bell icon that you see besides it to get updates on all my upcoming videos. Um, I would also request you all to send hacks, any hacks that you all think would be useful to someone else out there. Send us in our comment section. We'll ensure to show this hack on our videos and mention your name as well against this hack. Uh, we'll see you in another episode of How.